Okay, so making the sausage rolls is as simple as this. You take your sheet of pastry, leave the plastic on the other side because you're going to need that in a sec. Okay, you take your sausages. Um, let's see, we need two there and then probably another little bit. Okay, I like to take the sausage skins off because I think it makes the uh, sausage rolls more tender when you bite into them. Okay, so just take those off. And you can chuck them away, you can give them to your dog, suit yourself. So just strip off the skins like that. All right, where you've got sausages joining together, smush the meat a bit together like that so you don't end up with it separating when you eat it and half the sausage pulls out and then you feel cheated because you've only got a mouthful of pastry. Okay, and smush that one on there like that. And then we've got another one here, another little piece here that we can use there. And just smooth that all out, okay. And then we taste the cheese. It's really simple, just down the side like that. Okay, nice and easy. Nothing complicated here. Remember, I usually do this just after five o'clock in the morning if I'm gonna bring them to you guys in pastoral group. Uh, just finish off this little bit of cheese here. There we go. All right, then you're gonna need your pastry brush and a little bit of milk. So first decide roughly where the middle of this sheet of pastry is. I'm gonna say it's there. Okay, and you just cut down there like that. And wet that pastry with a bit of milk, it makes it sticky, it kind of acts like a glue. And then you roll it up like that. And roll it over and squish it down there like that and the other one too like that and squish that one there make sure the pastry sticks together nicely at those joins that you've made okay and then Brush a little bit of milk on it, like that. That helps the pastry go nice and golden. Now, lots of people say you have to use an egg for that. I reckon, why waste an egg when milk actually does the job really well? Why would you throw away a whole egg? Okay, so now I'm gonna just cut them in half and make them a decent size, like that, because we're gonna have them for lunch. and pop them over here onto this baking sheet which I've prepared. Now I like to use just the, the silicon baking paper because it makes the clean up a lot easier. Like that. You don't want to make them too crowded Otherwise, the pastry doesn't crisp up properly. There we go. And so that is ready to go into the oven.